Hello all, uh, welcome back to Mia Books. Uh, today we will go through the books, uh, Handbook of Physics, Mathematical Handbook, uh, Elementary Mathematics and Mathematical Handbook, Higher Mathematics. So, uh, Handbook of Physics. Uh, this book is almost 1000 pages long, uh, more than 1100 pages and uh, here you can find it, this is printed in 1972, first published, but this is a 19... Uh, 83rd edition okay so you have part one kinematics and particles work on mechanical energy then part two fundamentals of thermodynamics and molecular physics then part three the fundamentals of fluid mechanics uh, part four excuse me part four is uh, electricity and magnetism part 5 wave phenomena then we have part 6 uh, it is atomic and nuclear physics so finally we have appendices uh, dimensions okay uh, so uh, you have all the details regarding each chapter uh, formulas, equations, everything. So this is a handbook, handbook of physics. So if you haven't subscribed me books, please do. Uh, more videos are coming. So uh, this is the book. Uh, second and third laws of thermodynamics, kinetic theory of cases. Quantum statistics, elements of statistical physics, fluid dynamics, charged particles. It's super interesting. So, I think uh, Matt Sosser also had a video regarding Handbook of Physics. like counter so this is more almost 900 pages okay we are uh, this as i said uh, this book is more than 1000 pages they have fixed something here uh, there are slight insect attack so we'll go to the other book uh, so uh, this is mathematical handbook for elementary mathematics so here's uh, next we'll go to the higher mathematics. So uh, here what that gives uh, why we need a mathematical handbook. So this book was published in 1972. This is the uh, second edition, the second printing, 1987. So you can see the contents here. So arithmetic, everything. Uh, for quick reference, it's easy. That's how these uh, contents are made. If you want to review something or something like that, it's super easy. So here is uh, introduction. Uh, designation of the handbook. The purpose of this book is twofold. Firstly, it is de designed for quick reference to mathematical concepts. All definitions, rules, formulas, and theorems are supplied with examples. Where required, hints and suggestions are given as to the use of a ruler, how to avoid common mistakes, and so forth. Secondly, the author believes that this handbook can serve as a manual for reviewing the essentials of mathematics and even as a first introductory course in its practical applications. So that's the introduction about this handbook. So here he has given how to use the book also for quick reference, use the extensive index at the back of the book. Okay, so uh, initially logarithmic tables and all. Uh, tables of primes after that we have systems of numerators order of operations brackets uh, it's for elementary mathematics uh, you can use it as a reference book okay so as you can see it is completely detailed uh, you can find uh, you find a particular topic uh, using the index of content and you can go there and uh, read all about them or refresh your mind refresh your uh, 
geometry trigonometry okay this is the uh, handbook elementary mathematics now we have higher mathematics mathematical handbook higher mathematics by the same author uh, so uh, if this is a bit uh, thick, thick than the elementary mathematics okay so we'll go through the book so here's the i think this is the author photographer author uh, first published in 1971 this is the third printing 1978 okay now, in this we have plan analytic geometry solid analytic geometry fundamentals of mathematical analysis differential calculus integral calculus plane and space curves series differentiation and integration of functions of several variables we have differential equations some remarkable curves tables okay so uh, this is this is for higher mathematics as you can see uh, i'm go going through the book briefly vector geometry rectangle coordinate system in space condition of parallelism of planes functional notation differential calculus We have integral calculus, plane and space curves, series, uh, these are functions of several variables. Then differential equations some remarkable curves so you have uh, everything for high mathematics as a reference book so uh, we'll go through this uh, okay this is a uh, high mathematics method handbook this one for elementary mathematics and finally we have handbook of physics so thank you for watching see you on the next video